I think Anta really wants to have like some new concepts and some fresh ideas and collaborating with like a very known person like Saleh was a really good idea. During my trip to Jaimin, I worked with three young Anta designers to help with the creative process. Uh, that's interesting because what impressed me the most was like this immersion. How when you arrive at Anta, it was really a part of the team already. And during the make and play, we just show him the environment and after two minutes, he was already starting to create. So that was a big step because we knew that bringing like such a very powerful and creative mindset at Anta, that might be a prime, but it works quite well. And what I really like with Saleh as well is like day one, uh, it did that logo that merged the two brands very so easily and so obviously that make the, um, how to say the DNA, both DNA works together. The purpose of a collaboration is to bring product to fruition that both participating parties could not have brought to life on their own. I believe the outcome of this collaboration is an example of that. I believe that play, exploration, and most importantly, curiosity are imperative for the creative process. So, the four of us did exactly that. Saleh is quite inspired by nature, so for him it's very important, everything is related to nature. So for him that was the connection between nature and this, the nest was very obvious. So that's why I started to think about that. I spend many of my days hiking in nature, so a lot of the inspiration for my designs comes from those experiences. The Anta nest technology was inspired by nature. I took a picture of a bird's nest with a white egg peeking through the voids in the nest. This juxtaposition of matter and color inspired the aesthetic of the technology. Anta Nest Tech is inspired by the bird's nest. The idea that a twig by itself is weak, but when multiplied and organized, it gains strength. We used a very DIY approach and created about 30 new Anta silhouettes with simply our hands, glue, and imagination. Despite being given the opportunity to create product from scratch, I thought it was important for my design to live within the Anta aesthetic. The oval served as a great vehicle to maintain this cohesion. The SPO2 is the entry price point offering. The upper consists of primarily neoprene, elastic knit, and TPU. The beef roll lacing system communicates the tactical function that the SPO2 achieves. The SPO2 is a fully functional hiking sneaker. So it's literally about like the nest, the structure of the nest. So it's an inner uh, foam that's bringing the cozy feeling of like the nest. And outside is like protection. And we bring that by like this kind of a structure. So as you can see, you can recognize the nest. And on the top, you have like um, what we call the, the, the upper is only one piece. So it's an easy, easy to wear. I think what Saleh wanted, and, I, and that's why we bring this uh, kind of relation, is like, um, it's really to bring that fashion to outdoor, or to nature, and how natural can become fashionable. Anta Nest by Salehi Bembury. Anta, keep moving. <laughs>